Hello there. In today's video, I am going to teach you how to write numbers in Braille. So it is pretty easy to write numbers in Braille. If you have seen my video of how to write alphabets from A to Z in Braille, it will become more easier for you to write numbers. So if you haven't watched that yet, I'll provide the link in the description box for you to go and watch that video. And as soon as you watch that video and practice how to write alphabet after that, it will become very clear to you how to write numbers in Braille. Okay, so, let's see now. Now, to write any numbers in Braille, we have used alphabets itself, but there is an indicator which appears before the alphabet to indicate that that number is not an alphabet, it is a number. So, what I mean here is like there will be an indicator before the alphabet. So, if that indicator appears before any alphabet, it means that is not an alphabet instead that is a number. So, let us understand how to write numbers. Now hear the letters from A to J, OK, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I and J, letters from A to J are used for writing numbers. Now, how see there are 10 numbers from which all the numbers in the world are formed, for example, numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 0, if you learn how to write these numbers, you will be able to write 20, 200, and 22, 22. You will be able to write 365 3, 6, 5. You will be able to write 2500. You will be able to like write 2 locks. But if you don't know supposingly how to write 5, and I tell you to write 254. So, 2, 5, 4, you have to write. But if you don't know how to write 5, you're not going to be able to write this number. So, all the numbers in the world are formed from these 10 numbers. Numbers are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 0. So, in that way, the beginning 10 alphabets in Braille are selected to be used as numbers. Okay. So, how it works. Now, the letter A works as number 1, letter B works as 2, C, 3, D, 4, E, 5, F, 6, and so on. So, like that you have to go till J. And J is not number 10 and I is number 9, and J is 0, I is number 9 and J is 0. So, now, if you wanted to write 10, you don't have to write J instead you have to write 10, that is, as I taught you is for 1. So, 1010 if you want to write, so, you have to write A and J without putting space between them that will be indicated as 1010. Now, let us move further to understand this better. So, if in case I have written a sentence that there are 22 children in a class, so, I write this as. So, here how am I going to understand that whether the thing appearing after are like there are 22 children in the class I said. So, there are so after are what is appearing, is it a number or a letter how am I going to indicate that. We are going to indicate that with the help of a number indicator. Before writing any number, a number indicator is put OK. A number indicator is put with the help of which we can indicate that that alphabet is not an alphabet instead it is taken for a number. That dots for the number indicator is 3, 4, 5, 6. These are the dots for number indicator 3, 4, 5, 6. These are the dots for number indicator OK. So anytime you want to write a number, you have to put the number indicator. Without putting space, you have to write the number which you want to write then you have to put space and then you have to continue. For example, I want to write, I am 20 years old. So what I'm going to write is I'm going to write I am, and then I'm going to put a number indicator, and then I'm going to write 2020, that is B and J, that is 20, then I'm going to put a space and then write years old. So how I'll read this properly is I space M space. For 20, I'll put a number indicator I'll write to that is BJ, without putting space between the number indicator and the alphabet, B and J, that's 20, I will not put space over here, then I'll put space so, that is how, you can write numbers in braille so this was it for today's video. Thanks for watching bye bye. Hi everyone. If you like my video, so please give me a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any doubt, then you can write it in the comments section down below. I will try to answer it soon. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.